And a tragedy as a two-year-old boy is killed in what appears to be an accidental shooting. What we know about this latest case, frustrating law enforcement and our community. This is 100% preventable. The mentality seems to be that it won't happen to me. And that's how we start first at four. A two-year-old boy is dead after what appears to be an accidental shooting. Thanks for joining us. I'm Aliyah Blackburn. And I'm Nick McGill. For the past year, Fox 59's Russ McQuaid has been documenting the toll gunfire has taken on Indianapolis children. He joins us now live in the studio with that perspective and what he's learned about this latest tragedy. Russ. Good afternoon, Nick. Initial indications are the toddler got a hold of a gun and accidentally shot himself. Whether intentional or not, it's one more case of a young life loss in the presence of adults in charge of protecting children in their care. This is what it looked like in the 3700 block of North Dearborn Street overnight when officers arrived on the scene at about midnight. The little boy was already in an ambulance when police arrived. He was later taken to Riley Hospital for Children, where the emergency department has already treated five children for gunshot wounds this year compared to 54 for all of last year. There were more than 600 non-fatal shooting victims last year, meaning almost one in 10 were children and more than two-thirds were intentionally shot. This is 100% preventable. We've been preaching it over and over again. If you're a gun owner, you have a responsibility to make sure guns don't fall into the hands of our, our youth, our kids, the ones that don't know any better, but also have a responsibility to make sure they don't fall in the hands of somebody that's not supposed to have them, a prohibited person. Uh, guns are getting on our streets that way. Coming up at 5 o'clock, we speak with a neighbor who grieves for the boy but says adults must be held accountable. In the studio, Russ McQuaid, Fox 59 News.